What's up everyone, I'm Iteration Funk and this is a sneak peek of the trials update for Deep Mob Learning. The trial system is a way to level your data models when you can't seem to find that one monster anywhere in your world. You also get rewards for completing trials. So the first thing you need is a trial keystone and a trial key which needs to be attuned and you can learn about that process in JEI. Now I'm going to attune this trial key to a zombie. There we go. And depending on the on the tier of the data model, you will get a, a fixed amount of random affixes to this key, which will affect how your trial will go. So you put the key in, you get some basic information about the key and what rewards you can expect at the end of the trial and you hit start. It's pretty basic, you just need a 15 by 15 clear area and the layer underneath the trial keystone needs to be full blocks. Let's start with something pretty easy. Let's take a faulty model and place it here and let's attune a key to that. There we go. And as you can see, faulty level trials have no affixes. And this is gonna be a pretty simple trial. We only need to defeat one wave and we get to pristine skeleton matter, which isn't much in terms of trials. Higher tiers will give you much more. Let's, let's uh, go ahead and defeat that trial. Now in the skeleton trial, sometimes you will get skeletons with bows and I vary a bit, so I spawn in strays as well. It's important to notice that the mobs spawned in from a trial does not drop loot. Only certain mobs from certain affixes will drop loot. And there we go, two pristine uh, skeletal matter. So we could get bone or, you know, skeleton skull or some, something sweet. Let's take a look at something a bit higher here. Let's go ahead and make this guy into a max tier zombie data model. And then we will attune a trial key. Let's grab a few, because we can attune several at once. There we go. And we have some with interesting affixes here. Let's grab the Blaze Invaders uh, trial, I guess. And the, the max tier trials will have additional awards based on configs. So mod pack developers could add special rewards to the end of a uh, max tier trial. And they can specify to be the max tier for zombie only. So if you wanted, for example, only cookies from Enderman, you could do that. Now, Loot Hoarders is a bit interesting. It will actually spawn in little baby zombies, greedy, greedy zombies, I call them. They can sometimes or almost always carry valuables. So when you kill them, you will get, for example, uh, yeah, I'm not going to spoil it, but you can get some neat stuff from there. And here we go, a little loot order. Let's see what he will give us. And oh, there's another little zombie. I actually got a piece of diamond ore. And I should pay attention so I don't die here. Now we should be careful for blaze invaders. Let me get some arrows just in case. Oh, there we go. We got in invaded. This is not a good thing. Let's try to get rid of him before he becomes a problem. You're not part of the trial. Get out. You're not supposed to be here. And another one. That's 
That's unfortunate. Let's take care of him. And I'm getting kind of cornered here. Another blaze. Darn it. Oh, and a glitch at the same time. This is not good. We need to kill him. At least he's not empowered. There we go. This is quickly becoming a problem. This time we got some gold for the loot order. And that guy had a diamond axe. That's that's problematic. There we go. A max tier trial completed and I would say that was one of the easier affix combinations and we got some snow here so now it's we're getting this message that the trial area is blocked as one would expect anyways that became a rather long sneak peek so I bid you farewell if you're interested in more mod update videos or my let's play series you can hit the subscribe button and I'll see you next time bye bye